Good afternoon, everyone. Curry College Chief of the Forecast, Joe Shock here. I was looking at Tropical Storm Fiona, and there she is again. I got this. Uh, I got the same PC. I had to update the Windows 10, so things got changed around in the settings. I'll be fixing that. But anyway, here's a Tropical Storm Fiona, just named at the uh, 4 p.m. advisory, a 40 mile per hour storm, moving off to northwest at 16 miles per hour. Here are the uh, spaghetti plots for Fiona. And I think it's, I think honestly, I think the Fiona, here's the black line in here, is the NHC official uh, right in here. Uh, but I think it's going to be on the little, on the southern flank of most of these spaghetti plots on the southwest side. But this is going to go out to sea, no question, this is going to be raining out to sea in the longer term. Here are the 12Z GFS ensembles. Again, not, I mean, this is not going to get overly strong, could become. Uh, low grade hurricane as it gets into the northern Atlantic as you can see indicated by some of the pressures there here is the Canadian which I like a little bit better a uh, better if you will more clustered down to the south and finally here's the official NHC track and you can see here now here's where it is tomorrow today uh, tomorrow and then obviously heads to a weekend but I am going to say this about the track again I think that this tropical storm is going to be on the extreme southern and left inside of this cone maybe even a little bit outside of this cone where in the center this is going to take i think a more westerly west northwest track instead of a northwest track over the coming days as we get closer to the weekend and that's not the only system to watch there is another one that's going to be coming off africa over the next couple of days which also could develop and that will become tropical storm or hurricane Gaston, so we'll certainly have to watch that over the next couple of days. But neither one of these, either Fiona or Gaston, is going to be a threat to any land masses over the next 10 to maybe even two weeks. That's it for now, and thank you for watching.